this. Oh no! Wait, I wasn't done looking at it. There we go. Uh, this is the formal notification that you are in default of your obligation to make regular payments on your personal loan. Lo oh, wow, that's bad. Has been overdue since that date, and you appear to have ignored multiple requests for payments or a discussion to reconsolidate your debt. Foreclosure. Oh my gosh. So this is like, that's why she had to take this. She had to take this considerable amount of money because she was going to lose her boat. Makes a lot more sense now. Is there something to do here? No. Okay. Let's go this way. Now let's pick this up. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not good. Why are these people coming out here? What's that about? Uh, that is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? Hmm. This feels off. Yeah, they're coming right for Just us. Be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? This doesn't feel good. Holy shit! Hey, get out of here! What do you think you're doing? Freaking weenies! damage here you see this look at our boat we can take care of this man it's not a problem what do you think like uh 10 bucks cover it conrad oh whoops my bad let's make it 20. conrad well shoot you you think it's more like 30 i can do 30. conrad right, you guys drive a hard bargain but i'm with you here let's just throw in the whole pot Let's go. No! I guess they didn't need the money. Oh, that's bad. You are an idiot. What? They left, didn't they? That doesn't make you any less of an idiot. You got a funny way of saying thank you, Conrad. You're a piece of work, Conrad. Now they know you're... Little play. Now they know you have money. Are you trying to flirt with me? Is it working? I don't even know what it is. Well, when you think of something, I'll just be over here taking in the view, flirting up a storm. Hashtag wink. Ew. Okay, I think they're on their way back up. And I was getting used to it just being you and me. We need to light the grill. Oh, oh, pick me, pick me. You can call me Grill Capitan. You may light the grill, but I will never call you that. Oh my God. Conrad. Oh, fuck. Son of a bitch. Conrad. Conrad, you idiot. Uh, damn, Fliss. I I'm sorry. I'm just not going to say anything. All right, what we got going down? Am I going to be down here? No. Hey, what the hell is going on? Welcome back. It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. Uh. So something happened. Mishap. So, so, so I made sure that I didn't die. Uh huh. Uh, so why are you paying?
surveying the ocean. Uh. A fishing boat came by and got damaged on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. They were being a little surly about it, so Conrad made it rain and they pissed off. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge. So what drugs are you been selling? Oh my God, you guys, can you all just oh, we're selling a couple like drugs. One second. Okay. Oh. oh. Shit. Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come Proposal. I know. Oh. I thought you were down there with me. Nope. Nope, I've been up on the boat the whole time. <laughs> I think those fishermen are going to come back. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia. The love of Alex's life, and he the love of hers. What about Conrad, a bold fellow, you might say, or maybe you'd say arrogant. I would definitely say something. Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. I would definitely face say something. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure Special you. Special feature unlocked. Help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. You know, that just helped my praise, you know. You're doing well. Ooh, thank you, you know. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Ooh, I like that. Say, say you're doing well again. <laughs> it's like long British yeah, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> so we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death well certain i mean that's relative and this meatball meatball this meatball pulls a ring out of god knows where yeah where did you hide the ring a lady never tells oh needless what the say, freak this lady was impressed <laughs> uh, well play there man no wasn't comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped fliss maybe he decided hey i'll drink some and then he got drunk and since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. <laughs> oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Oh, no. Yeah. So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mr. Julia Smith? Let me check these photos, huh? What do y'all take down there? I see that like we we end up switching between all the characters. I'm checking out your photos that you took down here. This badge, Conwin Island. I was totally right. I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. You guys took like four photos down there. I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. You dummies. I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out. I love you, Alex. Yeah, I didn't think we'd be switching characters. I thought we were kind of like locked in. Oh yeah, this is definitely without a doubt anti-aircraft caliber. I guess it's the way they roll hey, the story. Hey, see my for... brother or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. I think they're fucking. Sure. I think they're fucking. So, which one is? Uh, you know, where the magic happens. On behalf of my family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, uh, it's okay. I can deal with children. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. Okay, they're not fucking. Not yet, anyway. That, the fact you guys brought that bullet up is gonna bite us. I, I feel it. I, I, do you know what the worst part was? Here. I literally Let's clicked on it. I had no choice. <laughs> oh, boy. Literally, just the bullet. I saw it. I was like, oh, what's that? 
<laughs> on it, and all of a sudden she she picked up. She was like, "Keeping this." Congratulations like, again, dude. Fuck. Seriously, I'm really happy for you guys. Can't believe I actually did it. You got the knife pad, Dive Master J? Oh no, not yet. Uh. I'm sorry. Can you just give us a moment here? On the dive. Julia, I'm just trying to have a chat with my brother. If you don't mind. Bro, move. Get out of here. Ooh. Oh my god, fine. Let's go and get the pad right, together. While this is going on, I'm going to change over to headphones. Wait, what the hell just happened? Recently. No you idea. Girlfriend? What is going on? Uh, yeah, I do. Well, I mean, I, I did. I broke up with her, though. Just too much to handle. Oh, one sec. What just happened there? I had no idea because I the thing is I could barely hear it because I've got the there's the um thing outside. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna quickly switch over to headphones on everything. Okay. Let's see how this goes now. Women, right? <laughs> hmm, yeah, women. They exist. Oh You're correct. They Brad. definitely exist. Right here. Brad. How are you moving the dialogue along so quick? Are you like sprinting from place to place? <laughs> No, it's just, it's literally just pulling up bits for You'll me. You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone, check it out. I haven't had anything to click on. Manchurian Weird. Gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage, huh. and it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. From the photos Alex took, you can see the flight badge on one of the corpses. That means the crew is from Conwyn Island, smack dab in the middle of the Pacific Theater. Called it. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. Uh-oh. Then what? Uh, whoa. Superstition? Is that it? Really? The dead don't sleep well in these waters. What does that mean? Silly enough to you all, but I was raised on this shit, and it sticks. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me. I'm sorry. Okay. Maybe. I don't know you should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. We never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Oh, they are not paying attention. No, they are not. Yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Are you sure about that? The story is pretty good. I bet you yeah, can spin a good it. yarn. It's yeah, it's kind of messed up, actually. It's kind of terrifying. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? Now let me tell this story. I'm listening, I'm listening. Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Mm. It seems legit. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> Conrad, you <laughs> fucking idiot. <laughs> the woman answers, I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twists. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, 
Splayed out on the floor is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Okay. We're sticking with axe then. Yeah, shut up. Let me tell my story, Alex. <laughs> Not you know, changing sometimes it. Sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. <laughs> okay. Why? Why is everybody making fun of me? I'm just telling you what the story was. You didn't say anything. So the woman, she's still hysterical. <laughs> ah, dang. Her husband did it, and he's still here, <laughs> in the closet. Ha! <laughs> the husband, eh? So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseas. You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeps uh. creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat with the axe. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face very in the dark. Difficult. Closer, closer, and he sees it's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> Shit. It kind of that that kind of made me tense up a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't I didn't jump, but I definitely like tensed. Is that like oh my? Oh come on, that wasn't scary. Shut up, Julia. Cheese there, corn dog. Okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh uh, no 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 no, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol. Somebody's trying to get somebody else drunk. Uh -huh. He's oh, he's that? risky, man. Oh, so you found a website that risky. tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm not sure. I'm liking Conrad. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> and four good buddies. He is a bit yeah, much. We'll see if he lives to the end, huh? But if we can kill him sooner, let's just try. <laughs> no, 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 no. The the bet still stands. Okay. Although I do wonder if at some point we get locked into different characters, you know? Yeah, that that would be curious. Because if we don't, then the bet doesn't work. Oh shit. Told you they're coming back. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. These have to be the fishermen. I don't remember. Fisherman. I don't remember him looking like that. I take it back. This isn't good. Okay, they've they've got Alex and Julia. Where's Brad? I knew it. You bastards. We should have moved on. We shouldn't have stayed here. Oh boy. Um. I don't need Alex to talk as much. I need the captain of the ship. He's done gagging me. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> I should have just left him gagged. <laughs> We're wasting time here, though. We should have just been talking. We should have just been talking. No, stop. We need to stop on gagging people. Oh, 
Oh. We wasted time. We should have only ungagged one. Almost free. What are you doing, Julia? She's about it. Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of... Maybe the fisherman I pissed off earlier. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How was that good news? I thought you were going to ask the good news first. You're such an idiot. Jesus. Yeah, that's not great. We have to get free, like now. This is a bad situation, buddy. Okay. Come on, Alex. You barely tried. What are they, zip ties? You're gonna regret this, you piece of shit. You're gonna rot in a cell. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, miss me. Idiot. You really thought he was gonna get a swing in on me like that? Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. They're about to knock me out, huh? Oh shit. God damn, bro. Stop it. Flippant. Oh, yeah. You know how to treat a lady, right? Uh, I'm trying to buy time for somebody, anybody to do something. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop! Please, just stop. Slow down. Easy. Please. Just stop, man. Come on. Just chill out. Chill out. We finish with him later. I think we were getting stabbed there if we didn't say that. My hands are sweating. Shut up, Junior. Get off me. Get off. Get off. <gasps> Brad. They beat the shit out of me. Oh, he got free. You bastard! Hey. Dipstick. Shut the fuck up. I don't think they're gonna hit her. They haven't hit Fliss. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with him. No. Uh. Gonna let me go? Are you being polite? Or unexpected guests. What? Yeah, we had tea. Oh yeah, we had biscuits and tea. All right. Turn around. What do you have on you? Don't let them see your hands. Once we get Julia back, maybe we could take them by surprise. Okay, they're coming. <clears throat> Fuck. 
No shot. Fuck. Motherfuckers. Is that the storyteller in the window there? Or is that somebody else? It looked like the storyteller. Julia, tell me what happened. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. Alex, I'm so sorry. What? What is it? They took my ring. Julia, it's okay. It's okay. Just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. Oh boy. This is tense. This is so tense. What did you do? <laughs> we had biscuits and tea. Fucker. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? They beat the shit out of me, man. Eight seconds. <laughs> Storms eight miles away. This is so tense. I love this. Yeah. That's that's how I feel. All right, I'm going back. <laughs> he accuses me of doing something. What did I do? Well, at least one of us can get on their boat, get some help. <sighs> I can get on that boat. If you can distract them, I can get on that boat. The dude with the gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> this is so risky. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys distract them. Conrad. This is so Just risky. Stay focused and get to the boat. Okay, let's do it. I have to kill these these quick time events. Oh shit, we were supposed to wait till seven. Oh, I messed up. I messed up. Grab the knife. Oh shit. It's amateur hour over here. Fliss, I got this. Let me handle it. I don't have this. Fliss, I do not have this. What are you doing, you idiot? Careful. Don't make this worse. Think about what you're doing, boy. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Just get to the boat. This kid's trying to kill me, or Take the gun. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> There was no way we were going to get to the boat and escape there. Sit down. Over there. You. Right here. Brad. Sit. Now. There was no shot I was getting to that boat. Stop. There was no shot I was getting to that boat. They said seven. Come here. Which one of you is going to tell me about this Manchurian goo? Listen, that wasn't my fault. Are you there, Maggie? 
he's not there. It was not my fault. I do not accept blame. Okay, I'm Fliss. Yeah. Yeah. There were, I, if I got on the boat, they were going to shoot me. We're just talking. There is no harm in just talking. You want to talk? Keep the volume down. Okay. Okay. You there? Hey, come on. We're just passing time. No big deal. Keep quiet. We're talking quietly. Captain says shut your mouth. You shut your mouth. We're talking quietly. Sit still. I almost I took my hands off the controller. I almost messed up. We almost got absolutely slapped right there. Come with me. Liz? Leave her alone. Brother? Please. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy. And there be consequences. Get it. <sighs> Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Do we read you? Everything okay? Over. Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us. Um, we're in a bad situation. It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. Sound like birds. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. Uh, nope, nothing's wrong. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. I mean, what are you going to do? No! Oh, shit. Oh, no. Everything's better when we have each other around. Do you get that? Don't you? Oh, shit. Oh boy. Okay, yeah, just cut it all loose. Uh Hold on. I can't help him. I can't help him. I have to help myself first. Where's Junior at? What the fuck, Alex? Not the time. Good job looking after number one. Real smooth. Great leadership, Fliss. Bro, I gotta take care of myself. Alex killed somebody. Oh no, never mind. All right. Oh shit. So that was kind of crazy. Still alive. 
things could have been quite different. Well, 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 <laughs> well, well. <laughs> I, there was no shot I was making it to the boat. We totally, we totally screwed the timing of the of the lightning. The second I heard the "Hey," I was like, "I'm not getting to that boat, man. I'm gonna get shot." I, creature I, am. I like tried to, to do the thing, but it literally gave me like a split second Tempted? to do it. And then also, I tried. You know the um, things where it turns. Okay. No. In you know the agreement. thing where? Oh, well, there. Oh, wait. Who no, no. it is? The Merchant of Venice, Act Two, Scene Seven. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Yeah, please. Everything <laughs> may not be entirely as it seems. It just has a flask. This game is sick, dude. This is Probably awesome. shouldn't have said that. But yeah, there's no shot I was getting to that boat. No shot. Uh, and that, and every single time I had a directional thing, like when the things where you'd like quick react, mm -hmm. I just kept missing. Every single time. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> So bad. I thought I thought Alex killed Junior is when he was like Alex what the fuck I was like oh did Alex kill someone <laughs> Junior, I just can't believe it Yeah, every time they're like, oh, Conrad, get to the boat. I was like, I'm going to get shot. Go. I don't want to. I kind of like Conrad now, by the way. He was I made him sassy with the uh with the guys and he lived so I like him now. <laughs> I was sassy as hell with him. They punched him and he was like, You should know how to treat a lady. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> That's fucking brilliant. Uh, nope, no thanks. Oh wow. Oh, I know this place. Wait, who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Oh, You're I'm Julia. Uh, okay. And I'm Conrad. Fuck. I think I need to up the brightness just a little. You know what? While you're doing that, I'm gonna do the same most probably. I'm gonna go with seventy. Yeah, it looks like it's impossibly dark on uh on OBS. Yeah, mine now looks better at 70% instead of 50%. I might have to adjust it again if I see OBS looking kind of goofy. No, 80. See, 80. 80 is good. I'm happy with 80. Mm-hmm. This has been crazy so far, dude. Crazy. I really like that we're deafening during the, uh, during the like high intensity Intense stuff. Games. Yeah. Cause I'm like, I have no clue what Mikey's doing. <laughs> what uh, I'm trying to do is I'm trying to deafen when it's like a point, like when the guys, like the people who are taking us hostage are there, mm -hmm. it's a deafen. But then when we're all alone, it's like a, yeah. Back in. Yeah, exactly. Uh, are you so ready? Funny. I am ready. Gotta press continue. It. There we go. Cool. There we go. All right. Yeah. Ooh, mine looks. I'm mine looks lighter, but not. Not too light. That's good. Yeah. Over there. 
Oh, L1 or whatever it is to walk faster. Shift for me. I think. Controller might make this easier. Oh, it could do. If you're finding it hard to get the button prompts. Oh, but I'm having so much fun. <laughs> my brace. Olsen, my bracelet, bro. Fuck you, Olsen. This man better stop pushing me. Ugh. Oh, that's that's a hand. You saw that, right? Yeah, I saw that. I can't move. There we go. I'm trying. I did not sign I'm up trying. To creep down. You try using I WSAD. Yeah, you might want to switch to a controller. It's definitely. Yeah, it just keeps going. Stay back. Yeah, it's a lot easier. There's something over here. The mask of madness now showing in the mess hall. Do you dare to look death in the eye? That's what we're kind of doing, isn't it? Kind of, yeah. There's something here. Oh, yeah. Miller. Olsen, I am reading. Okay. I hate this guy. Oh, he's an asshole. Oh, oh. <laughs> what are they gonna do? <laughs> it's so <laughs> funny seeing you just turn around. What's wrong? What's, what's up, Danny? Oh, what? 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 I didn't see that. No, I, I have subtitles on. Oh. I need to have subtitles on, otherwise, I would struggle too much. Oh, you found a thing. What did you find? A uh, letter to Private O'Neill. You're covering Patterson's guard duties tomorrow. He is sick again. First is 2400. Check the chart for rotation. Damn. Yeah. Midnight shift, huh? Olsen, you're in both to see. Okay, all of you into the room. I was really thinking that we were going to kill these guys off, but I guess that was going to be impossible. Yeah, from the looks of it, I think they were just we had no chance of killing them off no matter even if we got it perfect yeah we may have caught one but that would have been it oh don't lock us in here bro hey it's pitch black in here give us a light oh thanks Yeah, I like how that's still working. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, after all that. Fliss almost fell out of the boat. I almost had Fliss fall out of the boat. It was very close. What the hell is this fucking place? Dude, even those meatheads seem spooked. Um. Hmm. So what's the standard nautical protocol for being kidnapped and imprisoned on an abandoned hell ship? Well, technically, there are emergency procedures, but this is such an extreme case that... Oh, you were kidding. I, I knew that. Brad. <laughs> Come on, Brad. You can't just oh, sit around. Need How did Brad get caught? He was hiding. We're not exactly he, he in jumped the best out position oh. to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down... We got to take advantage of it and get off the ship. Yeah, man, this whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. Yeah, we got to stay sharp and keep our eyes out for the right. We're talking real loud with them right outside the door. It's going to be difficult to get anywhere without it. Hmm. So can't we just like hotwire it or something? No. You can't hotwire it. We need the distributor cap. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. 